Welcome to Plant Lifestyles. This channel we are dedicated to the teachings of plants. Yes, plants, anything plant, anything herb, anything that grows in the soil that has leaves, stem, and roots. So we are going to teach a lot of things on this channel. Yes, um, we are more concerned about the spiritual and then. Uh, the physical or the health benefits of plants. When you take your phone, you just search plant lifestyles, plant lifestyles, and then you are going to get our videos. You subscribe to the channel. Anything I post on this uh, channel, you are going to get an update. Yes. Thank you for watching today. Today is a new day, and I'm going to talk about a new leaf, which is not. A new but still a new way of using the leaf. Yes. Today I'm going to talk about the dry plantain leaves. The dry plantain leaves. This is the dry plantain leaf. In fact, I am in my farm and then this is the plantain plant. Yes. And then this is the plantain leaf. There are a lot of special benefits that comes with the plantain leaves. In fact, people will ask plantain is just food you eat. The plantain plant itself has a lot of spiritual benefits, especially when you take the leaf and then the cover of the plantain fruit. You see the, 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 the fruit of the plantain, you just remove the peel before you take the food content of the plantain. So we are, I'm going to talk about the plantain peel and the plantain leaves. I'm going to talk about the spiritual and the health benefits. The spiritual benefits of the plantain peel and then the health benefits of the plantain leaves. So stay tuned to the end of the video. The plantain leaf is more used to heal ulcer. Anything which is ulcer. Ulcer is a, is a sore or a tear or a wear of the body. Like when there's a tear or there's a wear of from the body so ulcer you have stomach ulcer you have mouth ulcer you have uh, that's the duodenal ulcer and then you have the retinal ulcer like anywhere there can be a sore yes so that place is when there's a sore it is an ulcer and you name that sore like or that place that is being uh, wear or tear with the part where it is being found so when it's found in the stomach, it's called stomach ulcer. Yes. Um, this one is supposedly for the stomach ulcer. It's very important. People suffering from stomach ulcer, you get the plantain leaf, the dry one. You are going to just get the dry one like this. When you get the dry one, you're not going to even boil it. You are going to put it in water. Just warm water or you just heat up some water and then put it in leave it for about two hours it will turn to tea you can start taking it as a tea to cure your stomach ulcer people with stomach problem apart from ulcer and the typhoid all those kind of things you are going to take it the same way you are taking the ulcer one you just put it in the water it will become colored um, the water will change to brown and then you can take it. It is also a stimulant to your appetite. Yes, people can't eat. They can't take in food. Like the small amount of food, they will be full. They can't eat. Yes. Uh, there are some people who naturally don't like food, like me. Yes. There are people who don't like food. That one is different. But if you know you like food, but still you can't eat. You know that you used to eat this kind of food, but now you can't eat. Yes, you don't have appetite for food for now. What you are going to do is, you are going to get the leaf, you are going to make a decoction, you are going to put it in warm water, let it what, um, stand for a while, and then you can start taking it half a cup in the morning, afternoon and evening, in the same way to treat your stomach problems. Yes, once again, this plantain leaf has a spiritual benefit, especially the fresh one. You can keep these plantain leaves in your room 
at night 11 45 exactly we are going to make 50 uh, 50 minutes request so it is 12 o'clock once it is 45 you are going to sit on the fresh plantain leaves in your room and then you are, you are going to sit fresh like on the fresh one not on the dry one and then you are going to remove everything like how you were giving birth, the naked way where you were giving birth, we were having nothing on you. I'm going to sit on your plantain leaves and then anything in life that is being difficult for you. That is where you are going to recite things that are blocking your ways. Things that are like things are not going well for you. You are going to make a request. You are going to make a prayer request, like a strong prayers to overcome those things. It's only 15 minutes, 11.45 to 12 o'clock in the night, then you are done. You can repeat this for a while, to, for about one week, for it to manifest. Yes. It's very powerful. Now I'm going to talk about the fruit. That is the plantain fruit. That is the fruit itself. When you take off the peel, there's the edible content inside. Yes. The peel is also a food source for the goat or the sheep. They like it very well. Yes. It is used spiritually for a lot of things. Here's what we are going to do. We are going to use it to this plantain leaf for protection, like the peel. We are going to use it for protection. What are we going to do? We are going to make the plantain peel, and then once you get the peel, we are going to put it in the sun for it to dry. Once it dries up, we are going to pound it to the powdery form. Once it dry up, we can pound it and become powder or the powdery form. Once it becomes powdery form, we are going to keep it in a bottle. We are going to get a bottle or a plastic or any container that can hold it. We are going to put it in. Once we put it in, we are going to add camphor to it. That is the nectarine ball. People used to ask me what is camphor. Nectarine ball. The, the camphor. Um, let's make the experience is on the screen. That is comfort. That is the experience. So you can check on Google for that. Yes. So that is what we are going to use. We are going to put the comfort inside the plantain tea. That's the powder that we've done. We are going to put seven. The small ones. We are going to put seven in. You know what? The comfort is going to circulate in your room. Or where the environment you find yourself. Don't cover it. Put the plantain leaf, uh, the, the peel, the, the powdery plantain leaf, put the comfort into it and then allow it to stay uh, stand in an area where you find yourself, either your office, your store. You're going to absorb negative energy and drive away any evil. Yes, the camphor and then the, 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 the plantain powder come together. The powder is going to serve as a, an anhydrous something, that is powder, that is going to absorb negative energy, um, like anything bad, misfortune, going to absorb them. That is making people not to come to your store, a lot of things. In fact, it is going to help you. Yes. And the same plantain peel is also used to block um, that is cases from generation. But that one goes with extra mass. Extra mass of adding that is the um, this perfume. We have the Florida water perfume. We are going to add it to it. That's what we are going to do. We are going to make a mixture. The further water, we are going to get one full bucket of water, one full further water, and then the plantain peel. We are going to make a powder of the plantain peel about yeah, one cup, one full cup. And then we are going to make a mixture. Once we make the mixture in the bucket, we are going to pour the further water in. We are going to let it stand for three days. After the three days, filter it from the impurities of the that is the plantain peel. Filter it. That is the powdery plantain peel. Filter it. You can also make it 
dry, but don't pound it if you're using it for this purpose. You can use it as the dry one, but not in the powdery form too. That's what I can do. After I filter the water from the, uh, the powder, you are going to use it to wash yourself, not bath with soap. You wash yourself. Wash yourself. You can repeat this for three days. You go to wash yourself morning and evening. Wash yourself. Tomorrow you'll be washing, you'll be speaking out. You wash any negative, any curse, anything out from you. And you are going to be fine. Yes. On this channel, I teach a lot of things. I invite you to subscribe to this channel. Yes. Dealing with spiritual things, dealing with physical things, health benefits of leaves, health benefits of plants. It is being taught on plant lifestyles. See you in the next video and then hit the subscribe button for more videos. Thank you for watching and thank you for your time.